take one. <laughs> take two. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Quiet on the set, please. Quiet on the set. Content kind of came as the solution to trying to grow further. I mean, it's, it's pretty obvious. Go where the attention is. Where's the attention? The attention is on your phone. So we're going there to capture audience, to capture new clients, to basically spread the word about what you do. And I truly believe that that's the vision for uh, the near future of all artists' careers. We have this beautiful opportunity because content creation has become so cheap to be able to use this as a marketing tool so people can actually see the surfaces of your thing, so people can hear about your ideas of why you created this table or why you finished it in this way. It's important for people to see who you really are, your authentic side, your work and your process so that people can really understand the value of what they're getting when they're purchasing something, especially if you're in the high-end luxury kind of market. The things that I look for in content, especially on Instagram currently, are variation. Switching between photography, video content, and real life content. And then I look for stories that allow you to express your day to day so that I feel like I'm getting a behind the scenes of your life or your activities as a, as a brand or as an entrepreneur or whatever. And then I expect some personal stuff where you are face to face with the camera. So I'm always looking for young designers who have a cool vision, who are not just putting photography up, but telling their story. People who are telling their story, I'm interested in that. That's what I wanna follow. And I wanna feel inspired. Some of the things that I see working right now are Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez this new politician out of New York who is changing the game in politics just because she's turning the camera on herself and said, hey, I just left this meeting and, and she's connecting directly with two million people. That's cool that I can sit here like this on a phone and reach as many people as a cable station. That's a game changer. It levels the world. So you have Netflix, HBO, Hulu, and all of these major channels competing for those audience members. But all they're doing is creating content. Right? They're just trying to capture attention. And so if artists can, who, by the way, are the ones that are usually sitting in those meetings trying to come up with interesting things so that these corporations can put it out into the world, those are creatives. Those are, creat those are artists. We are those people. We are those designers. If you produce good content and you give value or entertainment, these giants are no longer giants anymore. They become just competitors. You have the same possibility for the same type of reach. That's incredible. That's paradigm shifting. It's just about capturing an audience, capturing that attention. If you're at the top of everyone's mind or your firm is or whatever, you might get a call for that new Dior store or you might get a call for some upcoming fashion designer that wants to use your work. Like, how do you think it happens? It could be that someone forwards it to a well-known celebrity or this or that, and that celebrity says, oh, I have this. Or a TV producer or a, a great curator or a museum director. There's one simple goal with getting your audience. That's to create a sustainable life for yourself. Wow. I would click next episode. <laughs>